All right, welcome back, everybody. Josh Ruiz, your MVP host. I have a fabulous guest today, Tara Marks, brand partner with Young Living, and she educates and empowers others so they can use essential oils in daily life. Tara, welcome to the show. Thanks for joining us. Yeah, that's that's what I'm passionate about. Thank you for inviting me, Josh. Awesome. Yeah. So we're gonna get right into it for the folks listening. Um, Tara is obviously, like I said, a brand partner with Young Living, and Young Living is similar to the other network marketers out there, right? Where she is her own independent uh, operation, right? So entrepreneur. And Tara, let's go into what gets you fired up and leads you to your passion in what you do with essential oils. So I just love when people are ready to hear about essential oils. Essential oils have been around for thousands of years. Essential oils are mentioned over 400 times in the Bible. So that tells you they've been around for a long, long time. However you feel about the Bible, it's regardless, there, there are stories about them, right? Mm -hmm. So it's still you know, kind of this new fangdangled thing because we have this thing that's emerged and it's um, saved so many lives and brought so many people healing and, and um, better quality of life called modern medicine, right? Right. But along with that modern medicine um, that's developed over the last, you know, 100 to 200 years, there's come some side effects with that. So what I really love is you know, essential oils are coming back. We're learning how to get back to nature and how to support our bodies naturally, um, not just physically, but emotionally and mentally as well. So I'm so fired up, so excited when people come to me and say, okay, I've been hearing about them. I'm reading the stuff. I'm watching your videos. I see what you're posting. I smelled you last week, right? Cause they have an aroma to them. I'm yeah. ready to learn. That's when I'm excited because they're they're ready with that open mind, that open heart. Um, I know it's you know they can sound like an alternative modality for our health and wellness, but like I said, they have been around for thousands of years. It's just they're kind of essential oils are making a comeback, right? Um, mm -hmm. And a comeback to stay. Absolutely. And, you know, I can speak on that uh, from personal testimonial. Um, I, I don't, you know, it could just be I've conditioned my brain to think and believe in them or they really do do something. I have a diffuser on my desk that I literally run every single day. Um, I don't know what I'm mixing, but I just throw some in there. My wife has this giant box and it's a it's a buffet of oils. And, and I know you and I talked previously um, about some combinations, and I think you had mentioned abundance, which I ordered. So for those of you who don't know about essential oils or don't understand it or anything like that, you really owe it to yourself to have a conversation with Tara and understand and learn. And you know, just like I said, she educates and empowers others so that you can use essential oils in your daily life. Um, and, and if that doesn't say it right there, then I don't know what does. So with that, I mean, you really sound passionate and you can tell and you're, you're very enthusiastic, which I love. What, let's switch gears a little bit. What would you say your mission is as an entrepreneur or is it more of like, or am, am I rephrasing that incorrectly to say that you are an entrepreneur sort of like just by the way of being a brand partner or how does that work for you? So first of all, I did not realize I was going to be an entrepreneur uh, six years ago when I got one of these fancy little machines in my house, just because I wanted something in my house that smells really fabulous, but doesn't have, you know, the toxins or the things that, you know, give us headaches, cause respiratory issues, all of that. Um, it was, it, it's something that just, I fell in love with the product, uh, realized that you know, there is that financial abundance aspect to it um, and then fell in love with that aspect really quickly. So something that I'm just passionate about as an entrepreneur is, showing, like I said before, just showing, showing people another way to support their health when they're ready to, not everybody's ready and that's okay. I'm, I'm ready to help people at whatever point they're at. 
there's never, there's never any judgment. There's no tisk tisks. Like I'm whatever point they'd say, I just want it in my house for smell. That's great. Let's, let's help you do that. But something that I, I am passionate about as an entrepreneur specifically is I love working with other entrepreneurs because I love just being in the presence of like-minded people. Um, and a lot of us are looking to support people in different ways, whether it's through products or services. So making connections with people that are just in that mindset to motivate and inspire each other. That's, that's what I'm passionate about. That's awesome. And, you know, um, with talking with, with you and I before this, you know, we're definitely on the same wavelength with that. Um, we're actually part of seven networking as well. Uh, for those of you looking for a networking group, uh, Seven is a great, uh, great option, and it's a similar alternative to a BNI with, you know, not as many stuffy rules, if you will, uh, a little more culture oriented, I would say. Right? Is that a is that a pretty accurate statement, Tara? Yeah, culture, right? I, I've I've been a member of Seven for uh, almost three years now. It'll be three years this coming November of twenty one. And, uh, it's not, it's different than other networking I've experienced out there, at least in my, um, you know, local area. And mm -hmm. it's just, honestly, it's just an amazing group nationally and now internationally of, again, those like-minded business people that I, I want to lock arms with and be engaged with and can lean on and, I can support them when they, you know, need, you know, just a little boost or whatever. And again, it's just that open arms, like, Hey, come one, come all, you know, if you're looking, you know, for that positive energy, seven networking, that that's the place to be at for sure for that. Absolutely. And, and Tara has some positive energy for you as well. Don't, don't sell yourself short there, Tara. You are very positive. Um, and I mean, we even, I even took some notes here, positive speaking. We even talked about potentially doing a seven day positive spell, right? Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna turn back the Facebook group momentum. So look out for that. Um, next thing I wanna kind of lead way into, you know, the last 18 months has been a tremendous, you know, challenge, uphill battle, um, very different for some, very positive for some, not so much for others. How has it impacted you and what have you been able to take in a positive way from this experience? Oh, right. It's been an, an it will say it's been an interesting, whatever it's been, 15, 18 months, whatever it's been at this point. So, you know, I think what has really been monumental for me. And I see it for all of the people surrounding me as well. And just out there, there are those of us that are saying, okay, we need to, we might need to pivot. We might need to kind of ride the wave mm -hmm. and see what it's, see what it's doing and be ready to just go with the trends and go with the flow. And if people are like, okay, we're getting on online events, guess what? Go I'm on. doing online events. If people are like, yeah, I think, I think I'd like to get together. Guess what? <laughs> I'm, I'm helping people get together. That's, that's, I think that's what as business owners, I know it, it can be challenging. We can get stuck in that mindset of, well, this is what's always worked. So mm -hmm. why would I change what I'm doing? Right. And I, I, I get that mentality. It's really hard to let go of what has always worked. Unfortunately, these times are unpredictable. Mm -hmm. I, I don't, nobody could have predicted what was going to happen over the last 15 months. So uh, the best thing we can do, and I think it's just a, an amazing life lesson, is to figure out what people want, what people need, how we can help them solve their problems. Sometimes when I say solve problems, I'm not talking about, you know, monumental world problems. Sometimes I'm talking about figuring out what to do on a Friday night. I can help people figure that out sometimes, right? So yeah. we're, we're going to get together. We're going to have a make and take. We're going to make some roll-ons so that we can all sleep better or we can breathe better or whatever it is. So sometimes, you know, when we're solving problems as business owners, sometimes it's those, those little things just to inject 
um, some positivity and something amazing into someone's life. There you go. And, you know, I, I love that. I feel like, you know, what you bring in the, in the way of being a brand partner with Young Living Essential Oils is, is so underlooked. Um, you know, our health is the greatest asset that we have. I mean, I, I preach that tremendously. Um, as an insurance broker, you know, my duty is to help people honor their life and financial futures by protecting them, right? But furthermore, having a healthy life, right, starts with, you know, the, those daily regimens and those patterns that we use, whether it be medication, oh, because we're running to the doctor, you know, or, or we're doing alternative paths, right, or, or getting education from somebody like yourself who has, you know, maybe something that can work alternatively um, to putting toxins in our bodies. You know, I'll give you just a quick example. I was reading an article. Um, I'm certified in the Medicare space, which is primarily for seniors. And there's a medication that they did a 10 year study on that shows that over a five year period of people taking this medication in the older age bracket, that they are prone to having falls more so than if they weren't taking this medication. And, you know, it's really uh, disheartening, for lack of better terms, to know that, you know, we as a society create something uh, all over a monetary sense that ultimately leads to destruction of our own people, right? It's just, it's just flattering. It really is flattering to me. Um, I'm a big proponent of humanity and community bond. And, you know, I think that what you're doing, Tara, with, with Young Living is, uh, is just one element that we can all embrace and better and enrich our lives with. No, I appreciate that. And sometimes it's just something as simple as, you know, receiving a text message from someone saying, I slept through the night. It may not, you know, mean a lot to you know, some people, but to that one person that has broken sleep or they're plagued with anxious thoughts at night. So it keeps them from sleeping or they're waking up multiple times during the night when they get a full night of rest, just because they took a little bit of Valor essential oil, put it in this cute little machine and put it on their nightstand. Like that's, you know, that's kind of amazing. And Sometimes, um, you know, it's testimonies that are even more compelling, you know, a lot more compelling than that. I can't specifically share those because the FDA um, oh, okay. restricts me, unfortunately, but I'm sure you can all guess. You can all go on pubmed.gov and do some research on your own. Um, talk to people out in your community. People are seeing amazing things with essential oils. Yeah. What, what is the, is there a specific oil that you mentioned for sleep aid? Oh, it was, it's interesting. So in the beginning, you were talking about how you put all these concoctions in the diffuser. You don't even know what you're doing and you yeah, put it in. It's great. And it probably helps, you know, motivate you or energize you or helps you breathe better, whatever, whatever you're looking to do. Mm -hmm. um, in general, for the most part, and I have lots of books over my little library over here that says, you know, this oil's good for sleep and this oil is good for stress, all of the different things, right? And mm -hmm. Most cases, a lot of the times, if you're unsure which oil to grab, just grab whatever essential oil you might have already in your stash. Um, I did mention Valor. Valor is really great for stress and a lot of people love it for sleep, but a lot of people like this during the day as well. So they are kind of multifunctional. So this one during the day is great. Um, I've actually been applying this a lot on my wrists. I was applying it on my ankles um, before we started this recording because this is great for confidence. Build that confidence when you're speaking in public or if you're going to have a really tough converse, personal conversation with someone um, and also to just relieve stress in general. But there are like if somebody if so you're you know, if you ask me like, hey, Tara, I need help with sleep. I could name literally like I'm not even kidding, at least 80 different essential oils or essential oil blends from Young Living that can help you go to sleep. And some may be more specific depending on what is um, challenging someone with their sleep, whether it's anxious thoughts or it's 
a sore muscle or mm -hmm. maybe it's a snoring spouse. I don't know. And I have oils for that too. <laughs> That's awesome. Yep. Yeah. I, I was asking, you know, Valor keeps coming back. I know when I talked to you a couple weeks ago, you mentioned Valor and when I, when I filled up my thing the next day, I saw Valor in my box and I think I've been doing Valor ever since just because it, it, you know, it clicked, it was in my mind. Right. But I was asking, um, along the lines for another reason that my wife is pregnant and she's been taking, I forget what it is. It's, it's an over the counter, little pill thing, um, to sleep. And I'm like thinking to myself, like, I mean, I haven't said anything of course, but we have this box full of oils right and so yet, you know what i say to the I'll husband that's, that's sharing this with me yes every night before bed you grab an essential oil whatever you think smells good or maybe she thinks smells good maybe lavender maybe stress away maybe peace and calming grab a tiny little bit of coconut oil or young living's v6 which is another carrier oil and you give your pregnant wife a really amazing foot rub before sleep. Okay. I guarantee you that will help her go to sleep. Okay. There we go. So for all you men out there with pregnant wives, Tara just gave you the nugget of the day. It's a, okay. it's a prescription foot rubs. <laughs> yeah. Prescribe Dr. Marks in the house for sure. That is awesome. I will. I'm definitely, I'm going to be a little more intentional. I'm going to see um, if there's any specific blends for sleep. Um, Absolutely. But, but yeah, I definitely will, will take, uh, take note on that. So that's been awesome. Well, hey, everybody, look, check this out. Tara has an incredible website as well that you can find her on, unlockyourhealth.com. That's unlockyourhealth.com. And it's not for sale. Not yet anyway, right? Um, uh, how else can the folks that you're on Facebook and, and Snapchat and all that, or what? Not all that. Cause I'm not on Snapchat. Um, TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, I can be found pretty easily as Tara Kristen Marks or naturally made mom. That's my tag handle on TikTok and Instagram as well. So uh, naturally made mom. Do you have that as a website too? Uh, I do not. Well, you need to buy that domain, girl. I'm telling you. I'll have to look it up later. It might have been taken. I don't remember. I feel like it was. Oh, well, it's you... been a while. It's I've had that 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 domain specifically for quite a few years now. So, uh, okay. Well, you might want to consider it. Trade market. Yep, I love it. Trade market. <laughs> awesome. Well, any any final thoughts you want to share? You've been you've been awesome as always. You're positive, you're inspirational, and you're helping the people one at a time empower their lives and live better and healthier lives with these little bottles of magic oil. Yeah, so um, just so, for some final thoughts, um, just like with, with anything in life, if you just open up your heart a little bit, open up your mind to learn more about them, um, even if it's not me specifically, make sure you find a trusted resource and most importantly, make sure when you are using essential oils, you are getting your hands on a verified, reliable source of essential oils. Just like anything, just like you can get a fake Louis Vuitton, right? Um, there are some fake and adulterated essential oils out there. You want to make sure it's a really good quality essential oil, especially since you will be using it in the air that you breathe. You will be, you know, you may be applying it to skin. And with Young Living specifically, they even have a line for internal use, which again, I don't recommend with other brands unless you have specifically researched, you know where it's coming from and all those things. Um, mm -hmm. So, you know, if it is something that is adulterated, that can actually it, it not just be, you won't get results, not only that, but it could be harmful or dangerous as well. So um, Young Living, they are the only essential oil company in the world that actually owns farms. So we know exactly what's going on with the process. We know exactly what's going on in the soil. You can put your hands in the soil. You can see the distillation process yourself. You will not get that from other essential oil companies, unfortunately. So yeah, just know and trust your source. Yeah, there you go. And I mean, you know, you said that I, I couldn't have added anything to that. You said it very well, uh, know your source. And I can tell you from personal experience, you know, I tried just doing the Walmart oils, they suck. 
Okay, it's like you do get what you pay for. Uh, if you want quality, you know, it does come at, at a price tag. Um, but, you know, don't sell yourself short if you really reap the benefits that you're going after. So, well, Thank Tara. Thank you so much, Josh. This has been really amazing. Yeah, it's been a pleasure. I, I'm very thrilled to have you on. Um, and for all you listening out there, definitely check out Tara. Again, that's unlockyourhealth.com. Um, this segment has been sponsored by Health Market Advocates. Uh, thank you all for listening in. Until the next time, I am your host, Josh Ruiz of the MVP Cast. Take care.